Hello, I would like to preface this video by saying that I have 1,000 subscribers, or 1k, as many people do in this, well, place. They make a whole bunch of Hanabalu about it. I'm not much one, I'm not, you know, the kind of person to make a whole bunch of Hanabalu about stuff, but I figured I'd at least make an offhand mention about it. So there you go, a bunch of, a whole bunch of nothing. Ah. Let's get back into it, shall we? Hmm... We can go to the Heritage Valley. See the Rainbridge Island. Give a good look. Been around a bit and discovered something quite unusual. Namely, some unusual weapons. We have here... The Shadow Stalker. Quite the interesting make. We have here... I don't even know what this is. It's called an Ion Distorter. It's probably something cool. Um... Also found this snazzy armor set. I. N no clue what it is, but it looks incredibly cool. Um, and I found... Uh, where is it? Oh, there it is. There's the laser gun I found. So I think today is going to be a nice old weapons field test day. We're just going to give a couple of weapons a little bit of a spin. Just uh, see what becomes of that, shall we? I just got to find a couple of goons I can blast out to Kingdom Come. So this is the Lizur weapon. I think I'm going to keep that full clip. Do I have any scope? Ah, uh, there you go. A proper crosshair. <laughs> the garage isn't coming along too well. Um, apparently going too far towards Washington, I start having some issues with the um, uh, the surface. Just, I can't work with it too well, and it's really annoying. Uh, oh, I forgot to bring some ammunition for my... Stock, for my uh, which requires uh, spikes. Real spikes. Been scouring that uh, Scorpion 7 facility. It's quite the place, quite the place. Quite the interesting equipment as well. Very... Very unusual. Where did I keep... I know that I had a bunch of real weight spikes that I kept somewhere. But where? Here they are. And another one of those laser rounds. Okay. Now we take out the big gun. Ooh, that's a big gun. Ooh. Highly accurate, though. Very accurate. We got this interesting little aiming reticle. Um, I should have a laser somewhere, probably on my Cobra. Nope, that one does doesn't have a laser. Wait, wh where did my laser go then? I oh no, this one doesn't carry a laser. That's the Colt that carries a laser. Um, but I do want a laser, and I think this one has one. It looks like it has one. Oh yeah, now I remember. I took off the laser for. Uh, Military uh, chamber, adaptive chambering. Let's it fire a little bit faster. Always nice. So now we're gonna plop on the. Uh, uh, there we go. Look at that. Look at look at that. That's just a magnificent weapon. Let's see what it can do. Let's see the damage this puppy can uh, do. Have a good old day out by the range. See them there zombies think they them there clever, but they have yet to see the masterful skill shots and aims of Shadow, the master thief slash entrepreneur and explorer. As comes with it. Jinkers! What was that? No, see, the weird thing about these crystals that I still don't fully understand is, for some reason they fit in literally everything. Don't ask me why. Uh, I just want to get a good... Where did that one zombie go? There he is. Hello. <laughs> Like, that's a whole bunch of hubbub about a whole bunch of nothing. Sheepers! Look at this thing. This is insane. And the, the rail spikes are just gone. So this weapon will utterly annihilate anything, but you can only shoot it once. That's awful. It's not even... Actually, I kind of want to take off the... Uh... That's a nice scope, though. I might hold on to the scope. Um, okay, let's go. Uh, let's put on the laser sight. <laughs> let's get a couple of eyes. Oh, this one's awesome. Even hip fire, this thing is accurate. You can get a couple of good shots off with this pupper. This is uh, easy aiming. Um, so I received some interesting intelligence, as they call it. Very interesting intelligence. That I don't want to go to the... Um, Whatchamacallit, um, I do not want to go over to the uh, golf course until I 
am in possession of some biohazard equipment, which I managed to acquire. Also learned that this helmet I'm wearing, 100% uh, usable as a gas mask, which is really good. Let's go ahead and attack. I need to, to scrounge up a couple of zombies and hit them with that giant ion disruptor. Whatever it do, it's going to do ma ma magic, magic for me. It's going to do a whole look at this thing. See, for some reason, every single weapon in the world accepts that. I don't know why. Oh. This thing doesn't accept any attachments. It is just... Whoa! Wow. <laughs> what a weapon. What a weapon. Um, do I have my coat? Yeah. I'm just gonna shoot in the air, get a little bit of attention. Then we're gonna hit him. So that weapon looks like a... Mm. Rod, are you stinkers? Why are there so many crawlers out today? Guess all my cool weapons blew him straight out of the water, didn't it? Okay, oh, whoa. Holy pchito! hey -o! Unfortunately, it's also the only clip I have. But that was awesome! Damn, this thing's strong! Bit of an odd weapon, though. I don't know if it could really do that much damage, but that's cool. That's cool. Too bad it's out. Uh, I'm gonna put these things back, and we're gonna catch the boat to Heritage Valley. To go with the theme, I think I'm taking out the Hawk Sound today, together with the fine, fine Yuri. Um... It's gonna be great. Ah, oh, it's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna get some a lot of fun. We're gonna go full out. Let's just make it a theme evening. Have some fun. Oh, the hawk sound. I've never used the hawk sound. I've not really used many snipers over my stay. I don't know why. I just don't find them as enjoyable. Um, okay, let's um Let's go. Nah, it shouldn't be too far from here. I'll see you then, actually. So this is out by the bridge that I was talking about, the whole thing where they were putting up a defense or something. I don't know. They wanted to ride people away from it. I think they did it better on the other bridge, because here's there's just line mines. It's just, you don't go out there or you get fucked. It's that simple. It really is that dead simple. Ooh, berries. If I can get a couple of them, I can mush them all together. Otherwise, eating raw berries does some wacky stuff to you. Ooh. Okay, it only lasts like a second. See when they're refined, when you when you smush them together real good. Get some nice berry goo. Ah. Ah, vermilion. That's the good stuff. Ooh. See, I feel 100% now. So, I don't know why they broke the bridge up. Probably because of this. They just didn't want... I don't know what that is, but it seems to be up there. Okay, let's see if I can make this. I'm going to give this a look. I'll call you when it's safe. Did you hear that? Something just blew up. Come up here. There you go. We heard a big old bang. And a big old fire. It's some sort of... Ooh. Some sort of jetpack? See? That's a minefield if I ever did see one. They made a good job. See? That's my problem, is someone with a jetpack could just fly over. <laughs> no, of course I'm not going to ask them to consider the fact that someone might have a jetpack. It's just not something I expected. I mean, there are helicopters, but... Like, why? There's no real zombie threat over there, so... Hmm. The situation's got me iffy. Might not even be their defenses. Actually, I never asked. They just said stay away from that bridge. There's nothing good over there. Ooh. Ooh. 
That's the good stuff. Cool. But whatever that thing was, it was up to no good. I think our little friend from Prince Edward Island may be closer than we imagine. Or it's one of his friends. I'd rather not have to fight people that have jetpacks. That's just, that's just a massive advantage. Can you imagine having a jetpack and just jumping from building to building? Well, how big of a threat can the zombie apocalypse be considering things like helicopters exist? Zombies can't really hit anything at a distance, can they? So unless they get out of the helicopter right next to them... Like, I mean, there are things like nukes and firebombs, and zombies are easy to lure away, so... It really gets me. It really, really gets me. Anyway, I'm planning to go and do something else, because uh, the tips I'm getting about the golf course are very specific. They say, get a biohazard suit, get, get yourself suited up with whatever you can. Because once you go in there, it's not going to be easy to get back out. Which I think means that I might be finding a UFO of some kind. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Damn it. Stupid boat. So I've given this a quick look over. There's nothing out here by the docks. I don't know why this dock's even set up. Heritage Valley is very odd, because it's zombified, despite being out in the middle of nowhere, implying that whatever's doing this is probably airborne or waterborne or... or just born by bad ideas. But like any proper assassin, we're gonna take him out at the distance first. <gasps> Shit. <sighs> Frickin' bolt actions. I hate bolt action. Makes life so much more difficult than it really needs to be. Yeah, it's gonna do, baby. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when I come for you? You're gonna die, boy. You're gonna die. You're gonna beg for your mama. And I'm gonna say... No! Let's rock and load. No one left, huh? Guess I took out all the resistance in one... There you are. Get out of here, boy. This ain't your town. This is my town. Hehe. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just enjoying the fact that I got all the good guns, and they got none of it. This place looks awfully, uh... How do you say? Perused? Pre-examined? Already looted? Yeah, that's what this place feels like. Someone else already scrounged all the good stuff. Guess they didn't need chemicals or flashlights. A lot of flares. Got a tomato. Tomato, tomato is what they say, and I disagree. This place is picked practically clean. Some pile of rope over there in the corner. Even the garbage bin's been just picked to, to pieces. Maybe they left a gun behind. They left an ugly, just deteriorated white sweater vest. Awful. Awful. Oh. Whoever did this really uh, took all the, the best of the best and left behind the rest, didn't they? Wow. Oh, here's 18 Ranger bullets. Wow. Consider that jaw-dropping. Wow, what is with this place? Huh? Guess I should have expected that. Huh. I was just expecting something better, you know. Oh. You know what? I think I'll drive us out to the golf course. Just for a quick look. I'll show you what it's all about. It'll be an interesting visit, at the very least. But wow, someone's been uh, picking clean, I get... This is the feeling I'm getting. Someone's really been picking clean, huh? And when they talked about a survivor effort, I didn't think that they would be, you know... Picking up every breadcrumb down the street. Come on, there we go. Bloody hell, 
What did I even crash into? I never actually got that helicopter, did I? I think I'll do that next. I think I might as well go and get that helicopter. It'll be fun to have a helicopter to fly over the Space Needle. It's dark. Almost dark. So this is the golf course. They got a lovely little golf cart. I love that little thing. Ooh. Seems we got a densely populated area now. We all know how that works around here, eh? don't we, buddy? I don't take too kindly to densely populated anything. Right around this place. Don't forget the bullet drop. Oh, I seize you, boy. I seize you good. It's always half moon when I'm looking up at the moon. Ugh. Ugh. So, what's with this golf club having the shittest food I've seen so far in all of my journey? Who knows? Anyway. Can we even catch it from here? Should be looking straight at us over there. Oh, I can barely make it out. Gotta get a little bit closer. <laughs> so over there somewhere is like a digging machine. Okay, so there's a digging machine, right? And the problem is that digging machine. There it is. Dug up something. Something radioactive, and I think it's the UFO they've been talking about all this time. There was a UFO under the ground waiting for someone. Don't know how a UFO gets under the ground, though. I mean, I can understand that something crash lands, but it probably doesn't need to be dug up by an industrial grade digger like that. That's the part that gets me. Oh, great, the zombie's already back. Seems tonight's a busy night, huh? Let's make it count. Listen, let's make the body count. Little, little shits. Busy night. Busy. Let's get that helicopter and get out of here. I get the feeling tonight's gonna be a bad night. Detecting a lot of, as they call them, ill omens. Ugh. Got the shivers on my back. Ugh. Actually kind of afraid to go to bed tonight. This is not a good situation. If things actually go ori, I'm gonna have to speed up everything I had planned. But don't worry. I've got everything it takes to speed up all the proceedings. I just gotta book it. And I can book it. And then I'll take a UFO as far as I can. It'll be great. Anyone else wanna come and try their luck? I said anyone else wanna come and try their luck. Boy. You were not lucky today, punk. You were not lucky today. Okay, is this helicopter up for flying? No. <coughs> Sir, that's extremely rude of you. Please refrain from that. Whenever possible. Let's perform some final minute repairs. Fill her up. So now I'm flying a helicopter. In the middle of the night. In stormy conditions, welcome to you probably should have gotten a pilot's license before you tried this one. 101. I say we got a 10-4, 10-4, we got a 10-4 by 4-5. How about east back? I don't know. None of the lingo. So, a helicopter has the tendency to swing a lot, so you gotta push her forward and let her glide. You gotta know exactly how to handle that puppy. You gotta Gotta, mm, gotta give it that slow weight. I know exactly where I'm gonna land this puppy. Oh, that's gonna be great. It's gonna be stupid and it's gonna go horribly wrong. Do you know what they say? What's life without a little bit of uh, fun? Okay, so here's the problem. Once I start to stabilize, I need to get this helicopter on it. Push her, push her. Little, little, little push. Little push, little push. No, 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 no. Big push, big push, big push. 
Stabilize, 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 stabilize there. I say we got a perfect landing. I say, I say, I, 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 dem, I dem dare dare say we did make one of them perfect landings. Wow. I got my own helicopter. That feels great. That feels great. You know what, that's something that I wanted to do for a while, actually. Um, there we go. I kind of wanted to install these somewhere. So does this extend infinitely upwards? Nope, it has a uh, max range. Well, I guess I'll have to put these somewhere. Wow, these lights are shit. What if I put one here? What does it do? Um, I guess it does something. I kind of wanted to put them up. No, you know what? I'll put one over here. Maybe more off to the s no. more off to the side. Maybe. Good job. Yeah, there we go. But I got a bad feeling about tonight, so uh, I think I'm gonna stay out by the tent and uh, weather out the storm, as they call it. Why am I even sleeping outside? I should be. Well, there's not many walls, are there? I mean, it's extremely constricted here. Constricted here. I think I'm just gonna go out and see if I can find a place elsewhere. Ah, I'll see you. Uh, see you guys tomorrow when things have cleared up. I think I'm gonna go get my cop car and just sleep out in the whale to back or something.